the cabinet has decided that Malaysians do not need a licence to post their videos on social media in the wake of an outpouring of criticism against the communications and multimedia minister. In a statement on Friday, Dato Saifuddin Abdullah said social media users are free to use platforms like YouTube and TikTok to produce and upload videos without fear of being charged under the FINAS Act. The announcement comes after the minister courted controversy on Thursday when he stated that all film production, including those on social media, will require a license. The issue came to attention after FINAS claimed that Al Jazeera did not have the proper license to shoot and add the documentary title Lock Up in Malaysia's Lockdown. However, the news outlet has dismissed those claims saying that its 101 East show does not fall into the category of film requiring a license. Meanwhile, the Foreign Correspondents Club of Malaysia says it is still seeking clarification from the minister on the matter. We were very surprised because um, Finas was never involved in uh, this uh, issue um, in, in living memory. You never needed to, to correspond with Finas over a news production. Um, but the sudden statements about them needing uh, Finas licensing, uh, it's worrying for a lot of us in FCCM because nearly all of us have at one time or another done a video for work, right? Whether it's covering uh, um, elections, uh, protests, or just uh, simple interviews, a lot of us would have been involved. And so in the case of Al Jazeera, it is, uh, they're saying that a documentary produced some time back uh, falls under this. So all of us, whether it's last year, two years ago, how what about those videos? Are, are they going to be investigated as well. So we don't know. The, the problem now is that we have no idea uh, how we will proceed in this new uh, regulatory framework. Separately, Saifuddin also said the government will amend the FINAS Act 1981 by taking into account the current situations and welcomes feedback from the public.